warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere, and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. to business here. And it's Van Rijn. It's Shana! This could fall anywhere. Oh, he's really drilled it. Again now. Klassen! He's missed, but not by that far. But well, when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close. Well, this has been an aggressive attacking start from them. They've been very much on the front foot, and if they maintain this pressure, it's looking very good for them. That is a poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. Lazor. Now the pass. He's made sure that that won't get through. No, he's missed it. That was worth the effort. I mean, it was a long way out, but he caught it so well. Still goalless. Tries to get it forward quickly. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Ricardo van Rijn passes it through. The defence can get it clear. Tries a through ball. David Klassen. out to the flank good idea just poorly executed will be a throw in looks like a good ball through it's Shana goal Ajax a lovely header but really it was all about the delivery well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch.
Ajax get themselves into the lead. Look, we know they're in control now, but they can't let their concentration drop, not one bit. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, and it was a case of, of good awareness too, that wasn't quite matched by the, the right way to pass it. Only needed just a little bit more behind it, and he was through. delivery and all it needed was a touch yeah I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch and it was fully deserved he gave it everything he had Ajax take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. He has done it! And right on half-time, that is telling! Yeah, I love the finish, but I think had the pass been delayed for just a second longer, I think he would have been flagged offside, and I think you have to praise them all round on that one, from the pass and the finish. is threatening to become a really good game. Listen, goals change games. That has changed the whole... That'll be the final action of the first half. Ajax went into the half-time break with a narrow advantage. It is 2-1. Back on the way. Played out to the right. And it's Van Rijn. Ricardo Van Rijn passes it square. Danger averted for now. David Klassen unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Schoener, who has made his impact already, aimed long and direct, cuts it out, boots it upfield. Decent progress down the left. Looks to slip it through, and he's cut it out. David Klassen crosses it in low, and the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Showed him a clean pair of heels. Joel Volkman. Cadell. It's surely a foul free kick. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is.
Got a chance from here, but not the kindest angle. Defence has got rid of that. Klaassen. Rashedli Bazor passes it through. Rashedli Bazor with the ball through. This ball. And the header! Goal! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Schoener did well there. He was on to it in a trice. Oh, players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great poaching positions. How quick-minded was that? Ajax, two up and into a position of real strength. Tries a through ball. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Has he found his man? He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Now it's Schoener. Now the pass. Ticatel. Very well to intervene. Looks like a good ball through. Towering header. It's a loose ball. In for the follow-up. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Ajax grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. And the referee brings it to a close. A great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? At times, it was like Groundhog Day because of their continuous success in using width as the best route to goal. It worked a treat, and it, it looked a treat. Another point I can make is that the foundations for this win were placed near both touchlines because they were able to build attack after attack